I'm Shelly Shoosh, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my 2022 What I Got My Family for Christmas. I first just want to talk about two things before I get into this haul. So if you are here solely to see what I got for my family and not to see me, then I will leave you a timestamp right down here so you can skip ahead. Uh, the first thing I just want to say is I know that most of you who watch my channel are not subscribed. If you like videos like this, then you will like all the other videos on my channel. I post two videos a week and my content is all about creating magic in my home through homemaking. So if you enjoy hauls, if you like seeing recipes, if you like seeing all the fun things that I like to do for my kids, then do me a favor, hit pause on this video and go and subscribe to my channel. The second thing that I want to say about this video is that it is not a huge haul. Um, if you have been with me for a while, then you will know that my husband and I only do two gifts for our kids every year. Um, one from us, one from Santa. The reason for that is we just try not to go overboard in spoiling them. We have tons of family and friends that will do that for us. So on Christmas morning, everybody gets their two gifts. This year, I will take Luna to buy something for her brother and I will get some thing for from Maverick for Luna so they'll have three gifts to open this year but it's a decision we made a long time ago before we even had kids that we would just do two gifts and that would be it so let's start with Luna what I got for her this year so the first thing she got is this Chelsea doll cottage made by Kidcraft I got this on a Black Friday deal it was only around $78 I believe now it's around $100 you obviously can't see it we will put it together for her before um, on Christmas Eve and I will insert a photo right here for you guys so you can see what it actually looks like it is adorable and I can't wait to do all the things with it and then we also ended up getting her this unicorn nightlight but it's a do-it-yourself unicorn terrarium so I will also insert a picture of what this looks like over here this was super affordable pretty much it's like a fishbowl and it comes with the gravel and all the things to decorate and make a terrarium for your unicorn so she's going to make a home for the unicorn and then it has lights to put on as a nightlight my daughter absolutely loves lights in her room and has all kinds of night lights going on all the time in her room i should also mention that my daughter is three and a half years old and my son is one so if you're looking for gifts of that age that's what what we have here so those are luna's two gifts and now we'll move on to maverick's two gifts the first thing that i got for him is this fisher price camping set now if you have seen maverick's bedroom i have done an outdoor slash mountain slash woodland theme uh he does have a tent in there and luna and maverick love to play inside that tent this is made for the ages three and up but maverick doesn't really play with anything on his own like well enough yet so I did get him this anyways because Luna will be in there all the time playing with him so it comes with a log and an axe for them to chop the log and then you can make a fire pit in front of the tent they can pretend that they're doing s'mores and then there's bear gloves which Luna will love there's also a mat one side looks like the fire pit and then it's reversible to make it look like a picnic which is super super cute i can show you the back here where it has all the contents and anything that i got from amazon i will link down below for you guys if you're still looking for christmas gifts and the second thing that i got for maverick is this little whale toy so it has five different attachments that go on the top of it and it is a bath toy you put batteries in it and then as soon as you put it into the water water starts sprouting out of the top and depending on which um, attachment you put on it you can use it as a sprayer I think one makes like a little duck hover above it there's just a few different ways for him to play with it and I think he's really gonna love that so the next thing I'm gonna share with you guys is what I got my husband for Christmas and I'm really excited about this gift because my husband is hard to buy for he's the type of person that doesn't want anybody to buy him any gifts he does not want to go shopping for gifts he just like he's just fine he's he's indifferent to gifts so I ended up getting him a trio of Yetis because this is something that he desperately needs. So I got the Nordic blue color for him. And so he got the, what size is this? I think it's 20 ounces, 26 ounce. 
So I got him one for his water, the 20 ounce for his coffee, and the 10 ounce for his whiskey. I think he is going to really appreciate this type of gift. It is quality, the color is perfect. I actually wanted to go with the navy blue, but I couldn't find one of the pieces in that color and I wanted him to have a matching set. So I went with the Nordic blue, but now that I have the Nordic blue, I think he's gonna like this a lot better than the navy. So that's for my husband. Next, I'm gonna go over all of our stocking stuffers, well, all of my family's stocking stuffers. Hopefully I don't have to stuff my own stocking. I have been keeping everything in these Amazon boxes in my office and nobody is the wiser because I have Amazon boxes all the time anyways. I got quite a few really cool finds in here so I'm, I'm thinking you guys are gonna definitely get some inspiration. So first we'll start off again with Luna because I'm sure that's what most people come here to see what you get for the little girls. So the first thing I got her is this princess nail polish i love these little kid nail polishes because they are non-toxic and they peel off so i don't need to use acetone to get them off of her nails afterwards i also got her a pack of goodie hair bands a peppa pig toothbrush but this is going to be her first um not manual toothbrush automatic toothbrush i don't know uh, I also got her some new forks, some new toothpaste. This one is by Jason and it is the strawberry flavor. Also got her a new Paw Patrol puzzle. We have recently been into doing puzzles together after school. She already has two of these and she's getting really good at putting them together on her own. So I got her a third one. This is the uh, Mighty Pups, which she is really into watching right now. A stocking wouldn't be a stocking without Play-Doh and we always need new Play-Doh. This is $1.25 at the dollar store and Lello is her favorite color. And then the last thing that I got for Luna are these marshmallow pops. My kid is absolutely obsessed with marshmallows. So she's gonna love these chocolate covered marshmallows and then they have little candy cane pieces on them. Okay, moving on to Maverick now. The first thing that I got for Maverick for his stocking is this set of silicone spoons. So there were six of them, all different colors. He is teething hardcore right now, so these are double use for us. We'll use them for feeding him, but he also uses them just to gnaw on them. This and silicone straws, he loves them. I also got Maverick. I think this thing is so cool. It was super affordable on Amazon. Again, I will link it down below for you guys. So it's a tool set, but teething, for teething. So it's got all the little notches on there for him to, uh, to, to non and it came with a pair of pliers an adjustable wrench a, another wrench and a hammer i think this is super cute and then i also got maverick a set of baby toothbrushes these are by colgate they are like the first training toothbrushes so they're going to be super soft i got him these keys these keys are gonna be more like real keys because they are stainless, I believe. Um, and they have batteries, so they're gonna make noise and they have weight to them. It's gonna be like real keys. We lose our keys all the time because Maverick is stealing them. So the next thing I got Maverick is this Thermos Funtainer. This is just a stainless steel water holder. Um, so water holder, a stainless steel water bottle. Luna has two of these that she uh, rotates taking to school and when she gets home Maverick is always grabbing it he learned how to open it now and he gets every sickness that she brings home from school because he drinks her water and that is something that I absolutely cannot stand so I got him his very own this one has dinosaurs on it and hopefully it fits into his stocking lastly I'm going to share with you guys what I got my husband for his stocking his stocking is always really fun for me to put together. I didn't get a crazy amount of stuff for him. So the first thing that I got for my husband for his stocking is a pair of long johns. I actually found these 
at the dollar store. This is the first year I think that they've had them. They feel like they're decent quality. He wears long johns to work, so I'll take them out of the package and roll them up. And then I found him this uh, extra strength like pain heating pad. He has a lot of shoulder pain, so I thought that would be a good little stocking stuffer. He also uses resistance bands to help with his shoulder pain. So I got him a new resistance band because the one that we have is too tight or too heavy of a resistance. And then I found this caveman soap on Amazon. It is supposed to be all natural. This is the scent of pterodactyl poo. And uh, men's natural soap. That's a really good stocking stuffer. And then a few little treats for him. I got him some Kit Kats, some candy cane mini eggs, and then some Naughty or Nice candy cane um, Tic Tacs. He likes to have this type of stuff in his car. So there you guys have it. My very small-ish haul for what I got my family for Christmas. I hope I gave you guys some inspiration, some ideas for things that you can get your family for either their stocking stuffers or for Christmas gifts. I will link as much of it down below for you guys as possible so you can shop directly from this video. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new around here. You can follow me over on Instagram at mrs.shelly.shoosh and I will catch up with you soon in a new video. Bye.